<laughs> gang, gang. Buzz, buzz. Back off my broccolini. Get your life together. It is. Don't touch me, bro. I'm not touching you, dude. <laughs> Dude, you sound like me, bro. Step by step. I know. I listen to your. Remember that TV? I listen to your solo podcast, and now I'm I'm just trying to get through life, dude. Oh yeah. <laughs> Onward. Yeah. <laughs> Onwards and up. upwards. I've been down, dude. One step at a time, one bro. Step, one step. Dude. Step by step. Day even, by day. You bro, remember that shit? If you even leave the, if you even walk past the studio over there when the door is open, you'll catch a hit of it, dude. I know, <laughs> yeah. dude. I, I got them, them depression rays. Yeah. I'm down, bro. Like, dang, man. Where's my tail? <laughs> you turn into straight Eeyore, bro. Eeyore, bro. Yeah. And then and then be careful wearing a Raiders jersey in LA, dude. I had all these cholos, man. Raiders, bro. Got, am I here? I was like, oh, <laughs> I fucked up. The, hey, papi! I'm like, what? Throwing fucking tamales at me. I'm like, what the fuck? Bro, like you would duck a tamale. Oh, no, I, 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 ate, I ate a few, bro. I ate a few. I can only catch so many, like, dude. <laughs> Throw me some sauce. <laughs> hey, Tom, Tom, Tom. Yeah, man, be careful wearing a Raiders jersey in L.A., man. This thing was frosty. Shout out to my boy Will In Compton. L.A., dude? Dude. Anywhere, bro. You could show, bro, no joke, you could be an astronaut, land on the moon in a Raiders jersey, and a couple of fucking bangers will come out from behind a straight up <laughs> A moon cholo rock. alien yeah. will come out? Yeah. Hey, Holmes. What you doing up here, bro? <laughs> Bro, first of all, that's Lyle Alzado, R.I.P., bro. One of the greats, dude. Well, he wasn't that good, but yeah, for sure. Dude, no, but definitely. One of the greats? Huh? Great at taking steroids. Yeah, but still. It's, some, some of those needles get big, man. Those, you, get into those, you get into that 30-gauge needle, bro. That thing is huge. Quit touching me, bro. But keep touching me. I wore the shirt. Hey, but keep touching me when you're talking about steroids. Dude, yeah, he just straight had a fucking... Philip screwdriver in his fucking neck oh, yeah, with steroids. Yeah. Back in the seventies, man, those 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 needles were thick, bro. Yeah, bro, those things were huge. You could put, <laughs> yeah, you could. Uh, those things were really really big, dude. I even remember even being young, the um when I was a child, the needles were bigger then. Do you remember that? Real big. I had to get a tetanus shot in my ass one time because a dog bit me in the booty. Yeah. I remember this needle was like this. Bit him, or I bet you snuck over there and put it in his mouth. Dude. <laughs> <laughs> ah, you <he> bit me. <laughs> <laughs> Let's be honest, bro. You definitely seem like the kind of guy who will sneak a cheek into a Jack Russell, bro. <laughs> Let's be real honest. Dude. Hey, for real, is this what happened? Some one of my, I think I was in fourth grade. Friend Street got struck by lightning. He's like, oh, you got to see it, man. So all the kids are like, oh, sick. So we go back there, and they push me and close the gate. And I'm like, I don't see no tree struck by lightning. And I see a Rottweiler. Oh. Bro, good thing I fucking <laughs> Spider-Man this shit. This, <laughs> because it, he was going for my dick. You sound piece. like Brian right Hi-ya. there. <laughs> Dude, he bit me right on the ass. Did he? Yeah, they could have killed the Rottweiler. Yeah. I'm in fourth grade. <laughs> Rottweilers are really, they're, they're honestly, dude, they're the black men of dogs. Dude, yeah. Let's be honest, bro. Yeah, dude. Dude, I do not mess with Rottweilers, bro. Never. That was a dog when I was growing up, dude. That was the most dangerous dog. They had German Shepherd, got kind of wild, and then Rottweiler. Rotties were the Rots, thing. Man, yeah. And they they were like a really rap thing. Remember, that? weren't they like t shirts? There was like t shirts of them with like chains on yeah, them. Yeah, Snoop Dogg turned into one. Of yeah, them. that's oh, right. Yeah. Was that a Rottweiler? Yeah. That was a Doberman. Yeah. Oh, that was a Doberman. Yeah, Doberman. Oh. So Someone turned in a Rottweiler on that video. But didn't Junkyard Dog, did JYD have a Rottweiler ever with him that came into the ring? Junkyard Dog? Oh, I don't know. I remember Rottweilers growing up being like associated with hip hop. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, I remember even just then pit bulls took over. In the area, you would see, like, if I I just remember when I was young, if black guys had a dog or a lot of times, it was a Rottweiler. Was that a thing, Derek, or am I just making that up? No, no, 100%. All my my bigger black, the bigger the black guy, the bigger the Rottweiler, too. Yeah. Every time. That's just scary. Hey, uh, type in uh, Rottweiler hip hop. But I could I could understand that if you look at a Rottweiler, it looks like the baddest ass dog. White really people does. had Spuds McKenzie, which was that. I don't know if we can bring up Spuds McKenzie. Yeah, the Target dog. He's always partying all the time. Remember, he was drinking <laughs> beer and shit. That Spud, was the one. Yeah, Spud that passed was, away. He was this is why white people I think have been struggling overall is just because the dog that they chose even years ago shows. If you just get an image of the dog. 
His nose looks like mine. Look it's at him. He's at the beach. Yeah, what is he doing? He's drinking Bud Light. He's always, he's always partying. <laughs> he was the party dog. He has an eye patch. Like, he's not <laughs> He's not doing well. That was Target's main thing for grip. Dude, when I was growing up, that was a big uh, mom would get a Spuds McKenzie stuff all the time. Yeah, me too, man. Yeah. Like the stuff Spud McKenzie. Yeah. He was a national hit. Him and the Domino's guy. Remember the Red Domino's guy? They even made a video game of him. Domino's Pizza guy. Oh, the Noid? The Noid. The Noid, bro. Oh, man, I'm touching what me. I wore the shirt. You. Do not touch me. Right, keep touching me. Does it say keep touching me on the back? We need a new shirt. Wow, that's how cheap we are, guys. Wow. Right there, dude. One side, that's huh? That's a perfect example of how cheap we yeah, are. It is. <laughs> you want to look at the back, bro? Oh, this, you'll see what it says on the back. <laughs> Write it yourself. <laughs> Write it yourself, dude. You yeah. know what it says. Write it yourself, <laughs> dude. We just assume you know what's up. Bro, it's like I saw a homeless dude earlier shirtless had written 24 for Kobe Bryant on his chest. He had oh, a spray damn. painted on his chest. Hell yeah. Did you get money? Huh? <laughs> no, dude. Oh, I would have. <laughs> I drove way out of my way to go around him. Yeah. That's right. The Noid, man. He was a big deal. He had Avoid a video game. the Noid. Avoid Remember the him? Noid. Was there a video game? Yeah, I had, I had it on Nintendo. Bro, the, let, we're going to be honest. What really happened for you, Brendan, was uh, it was a puppet show that your folks did for you. No, there it you, is. There it is. Look, the, that's the cover on the far left. That's it right there. And he would bounce around the city. Yo, Noid. <laughs> he would bounce around the city. Is Noid a racial slur? I feel like it is, man. Yeah, I think that's why they got rid of it. It had something to do with their pepperoni pizza. Yo, Noid. Yeah, some, some of these being, Noids. These Noids. Oh, you annoyed. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, you a little Noid. Oh, yeah, yeah, dude. What's up, Noid? Yeah, like somebody from Norway. Yeah, Noid. Oh, look at these Noids out here with their skis. <laughs> oh, these, these Noids, man. Yeah, I'm sick yeah. of these Noids, bro. Oh, dude, bro, with their ear muffs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, any guy that's awesome. got to touch something furry on his head to hear you, yeah, I'm out. Man. I'm out, bro. Yeah, the Noid, bro. That's it. Are you high, Derek? You look unbelievably irrationally high today. Every time we've met. <laughs> ever. His eyes are always red. Never not been high. Oh, damn. Not oh, one time. High. Why am I always high? I like weed. I've been, no, high, no, I've been no. high since college. Oh my every day. You, you, every you day wake up and smoke? Yeah. yeah. Oh, you, you wake up and can, you can't function unless you wake up and smoke? Yeah, I just gets, gets my day started. Yeah, I don't give a shit, Derek. I'm just saying you're always high, even even around me, even on the road? 24-7. <laughs> wow. You have a problem. <laughs> <laughs> wait, 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 wait. You don't drink real, water. You have a don't, real problem. Don't, yeah, you don't even drink water. Drink? This guy doesn't drink. Yeah, you're wow. calling me out. First team, no water, baby. <laughs> What's up, bro? Dude. I haven't had water in ages, dog. You said that on the road. My pee is Thick like brown sugar, dude. <laughs> and my kidneys hurt, bro. <laughs> but I refuse to do it. This dude's over here pissing molasses. Fucking dry all Alzado over here. Dude. You gotta fucking put some. Dude, let's get two buckets of water and just set his feet in him while he's here, man. You gotta start at the root, bro. You gotta hydrate. Dude, you're right. I just stay on coffee, dude. Dude, if I, I just saw one of your tattoos walk off your arm, bro. It's so dry. Yeah. Damn, do you do, you wake up and smoke? Wake up and smoke. You can't. What, what, you've always been like that. Oh, bro, I've been yeah. Have since probably at 2010, I've been high every day. Ten years. Yeah. And does your whole family smoke marijuana there? No, it's just me. Oh wow. Yeah, just me. Okay. Does your girl smoke too? Girl smokes. Yeah. Did she smoke before she met you? Yeah, she was already smoking. So did we met. Or did you get her kicking? No, I didn't. Don't you? I didn't get her kicking. She probably didn't smoke as much. Probably didn't smoke as much. Wow. But wow. I, I'm just, I'm just smoking. Wow. You're like a Puerto Rican Joe Rogan. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> just smoking all the time. Yeah. Dude. You need sober October, bro. <laughs> no. You need water. Wow, look Every how defensive. Day. I need water. You don't drink water? Never. What? I don't trust it, dude. <laughs> what do you drink? Uh, according to your hair, you drink olive oil. So <laughs> what are you drinking, dude? <laughs> dude, what are you <laughs> Dude, according to your hair, you drink sleepless in C Seattle. What's up, Meg Ryan? What's up, Doug? What's up, dude? I hope he emails. <laughs> dude, you, you fucking... Bro, you look like fucking Dyke Allstott, dude. You look like a fucking big drive Shout fullback. Shout out to Mike Allstott. Yeah. yeah, dude. Why hasn't Mike Allstott been on here, dude? Yeah, why can't we get him on here? I don't know. How about roast my CTE? <laughs> yeah. Dude, yeah, how does CTE not have a game show? Dude, why can't I be the host of Roast My CTE, roast my dude? CTE. 
Dude, it's like if Brendan should have a board game, yeah. And it's uh, it starts off kind of like uh, Candyland and just dead ends at a horrible fucking game of Scrabble. No, dude, no, dude. It's like Monopoly, all right? Yeah. You gotta get certain CT, and I'm Park Place, baby. Oh, you're, yeah. you're Baltic Avenue. Yeah, dude, yeah you're Baltic yeah. Avenue, dude. Just hanging out on a. a you're that purple. Post. You're that purple <laughs> resident. Hello, that boy. shit was sixty bucks. <laughs> Percocet. Molly Percocet. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Get the gate. Get the gate, dude. <laughs> Dude, rate my CD. What a great game. <sighs> Comedy Central, what's up, bro? Yo. Just dropping ideas What's here. up? Comedy Central's going out of business. That's what's <laughs> up with them, dude. <laughs> they just let go of everybody over there, man. They're basically, they're, they're barely they an app. They did. They're barely an app. Well, uh, well, let's get into it, dude. Wait, dude, you're... Uh, you're thinking about going to Hawaii? Are you in Vegas this weekend? I'm in Vegas this weekend. I'm in Las Vegas. Ooh, where are you teaming up at the with Mirage? The, oh, okay. I thought you were doing something with the Blue Man Group. Oh no, I wish. <laughs> God, they're great. Have you seen I them? Get in there. God, Derek won't shut the fuck up about the Blue Man. Yo, group. they're amazing. Take your kids, everybody. <laughs> Blue Man Group. This is really not. You know, they don't pay me. I just they should. Is that a racial thing? Like you guys? It's like you guys can associate with that kind of thing, or is there something that I, that I don't know about? Like, what? Um, I'm they, black. That's I know, but I'm just saying you see like another kind of a... No, everybody, we were the only black family there. But really? man, they were wow. awesome. There was except for of... the Blue Man group, kind of. <laughs> yeah, except for them. Them niggas was there. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Now, so is it okay to call the Blue Man group the N-word? <laughs> oh, for sure, dog. <laughs> oh. The way they performed? Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Ari Manis would probably call him it. Yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, no, I meant Shafir. My bad. Yeah. Oh, no, dude. My oh, oh. <laughs> bad, man. Oh, just joking, man. So you're going to Vegas? Just joking, man. I was hacked. <laughs> <laughs> I was hacked, bro. I was hacked, man. I don't even know what happened. But did something just happen, guys? I just felt like oh, I, I just fell asleep or something. <laughs> was I saying something? Dude, no, so you, you, so you you're know? going to Vegas? <laughs> Yeah, that's what we're talking about. You're going to Vegas. Yeah, have you guys and ever been? A few times. With family. Few times. Yeah. Oh, nice. What'd you What'd you see there? Uh, I remember when they had that big pirate ship kind of hotel. And Treasure pi- Island? Yeah. Is it still there? Still there, yeah, dog. When's the last time you went? Damn, it's been a while. <laughs> God, dog. <laughs> but dude, when he went, it was a real ship. It was like real pirates <laughs> landing. <laughs> <I thought> <laughs> <so>. <laughs> Bro, you were so high back then. Yeah. Yeah, damn. I was, was like so nine. High. Bro, it's so easy. Here's the thing what parents don't realize. If you if you get your kids high, it's so easy to take them on vacation, dude. Yeah, man. Take them anywhere. Take them to Chuck E. Cheese. Yeah. Tell them it's fucking circus circus. Yeah. yeah. Take them to the cheese section of the grocery store and fucking tell them to take, have a blast. Yeah. Take them to the cheese factory. Tell them it's Italy. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, I used to have this dream where I was running this dirty business where I was taking blind people to um, Antarctica or Iceland or something. Yeah. But really, it was just a regular place, and I had people put ice all over the ground in walls. And then when they got there, they thought they were in like an exotic country. By and dream, we charged do, them a lot. By dream, do you mean before you started selling tickets on the road? <laughs> <laughs> no, it was just a bad dream, and I had to run the ship. <laughs> just... Just stressful as fuck. Oh, it's so crazy. Just dude. hustling. Dude, There's last like 2,000 time- blind people on a cruise ship. <laughs> and I was the captain. Every time I'd have this dream, I'd be like, fuck. Here we go. <laughs> I had to work a whole shift, like an eight hour shift as the captain. What a nightmare. <laughs> it was horrible. Dude, last time I was in Vegas, I was doing a show at the Orleans. Mm-hmm. And they wouldn't let me bring, I was going to bring Derek and like, oh no, we got the opener. <clears throat> we got the opener. This guy, Jimmy, he's been on comedy for about 70 years. I'm like, all right, whatever. I, so I get there. 70 years. Legit 70 years. <laughs> He's the guy to go, dynamite. Jimmy Walker? Jimmy Walker. Holy Jimmy, shit. Jimmy Walker? Walker. He was like an original at the comedy store. I know exactly who oh, he is, Oh, yeah. Dude. His name's in the OR. I've seen every episode of uh, the show name that I can't even remember. Fat right. Albert? Good times. Yeah, good oh, I thought time. it was Fat Albert. Temporary <laughs> it was so Good times. What do you mean, <laughs> booger? Janet Jackson was in good yeah, times, Yeah, she dude. was, dude. I don't, I don't know. I'm not familiar with the show. I know he had the dynamite thing. Anyway, well, so he had the dynamite thing, but he they never he never really got any residuals from that man. These men worked at a time. You want to talk about Hollywood fucking people? Ooh. They worked at a time when these. I mean, yeah, I don't think he sees residuals from that show. Yeah, he's still hosting. He still has to host. And that show still airs places, dude. He's still you go on the to, road uh, like 300 Vietnam, days. Vietnam. You go to, uh, you know. Africa just got it. They're waiting for season Maine. two. They you can't go to wait. Maine. Yeah, places like that. That show still airs, brother. Yeah, I don't know what his contract is with the show and shit. All I know is, is uh, he was one of a kind, man. One of a kind. He so he walked. I'm wait where I'm waiting to go on stage. He walks up. He goes, he won't look me in the eye. He's like looking off like this and like, go meet Jimmy. I'm like, what's up, man? I don't. I'm not familiar with him at all. I just know he's this older dude open for me. I'm like, this is a terrible idea for my crowd. He walks up. He goes, 
I've been doing this over 50 years. He goes, I know everybody. Never heard of you. <laughs> <laughs> and just stayed there. Went. <laughs> and I went, uh, all right, man. Well, have a good have a good show out there. I, I don't know what you want me to do. You should have been like, I'm dynamite. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. It was, yeah. it was so awkward. Dude. And then he went out there, bombed, and then I roasted him when I went on stage. Because oh. he, he was selling what? CDs. He was selling CDs. Yeah. I went, make sure you get your CDs from Jimmy Walker, everybody. Oh my. I want to sign your 8 by 10 out the way. That's what he wanted to do. It's like, what the fuck is Dude, going on? Dude, he's a legend, bro. <laughs> Dude, but how about- That's like having freaking Frederick Douglass' son, Frederick Douglass Jr., perform for you, brother, and with you. And you treat him like that. No, it's like, yeah, I don't know, dude. It's like bro, that Charlie guy's a, Chaplin. Me, that guy's a legend. For sure, he's a legend. For sure. Yeah, great guy. So then when we're going out there, you know, when they call my name, I'm going out there. I go, hey, good set, brother. And he goes, don't touch me. Don't touch me. That's why I was like, oh, cool, man. All right. Check this out, dude. You want to slang DVDs and sign 8 by 10s Check this out, Dino Mike. Yeah. Orleans, out. What? It's Orleans, dude. No, it's not, dude. I wasn't at that fancy hotel. Oh, yeah. I'm behind that, oh, man. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my bad. Everyone's dude. eating ribs and shit, yeah. and macaroni and cheese. Yeah, the further you get from Vegas, the the the, the same thing start losing letters. You know, yeah, man, it gets crazy out there, dude. Yeah, you're at the Mirage. You're at the Marag. <laughs> you're at the IRA. IRA. Right. Next exit. Yeah. You plan? You're planning to go to uh, Hawaii though? You're saying? Yeah, in March I'll maybe even go to Maui, do some shows over there. <clears throat> so do some shows and chill out, or what? Yeah, do some shows, chill out. It's Dude, nice who, over there. Who man. takes more vacations, you or teachers? I mean, you take more vacations than anybody I know. I was um, talking about you need a break. Oh yeah, dude, I de definitely need a break, man. <laughs> just surrounded dude, by just too much something. racism out here. <laughs> <laughs> man, when you're selling stuff online, you know uh, the orders can be a real pain, Brendan. Dude, when you're selling stuff online, it's the dark web out there, dude. How do you know it's going to get there on time? Mm -hmm. What are you going to do? It's just such a hassle. Oh, I bought a thing of uh, summer sausage and a bunch of, um, uh, like, a little kind of sweater showed up. <sighs> dude, I bought cheese, and they just sent me a bunch of kid shoes. <laughs> really? Yeah, it doesn't make sense. Bro. Dude, you might be a dang <laughs> pedophile, dude. Yeah, then maybe. I don't know, dude. Thank God for ShipStation, Amen, man. Amen, brother. The fastest, easiest, and most affordable way to manage and ship your orders. Just a few clicks, and you're managing your orders, printing out labels, getting your product out as fast as you can be, so your customers are happy. Yep. ShipStation makes it easy. Well, it's just sad that we live in this day now where the U.S. postal system has gone to S-H-I-T, so we got to really spruce it up now. And that's what I'm saying with ShipStation is. You can use USPS. You can use FedEx, UPS, even Amazon Fulfillment. You can check out all of the different options. But you got to take that extra step if you are going to get something where it needs to be on time. Yeah, be a big boy about shipping, man. No wonder big ShipStation boy. is the number one choice of online sellers. Just big ship more boy. in less time with the best rates possible. Yep, and right now, King and the Sting listeners can try ShipStation free. Four viewers. Or viewers, Don't gang shit, out, bro. Respect, bro. Come buzz, on, YouTubies. You can try ShipStation for free for 60 days when you use offer K-A-T-S. And there's no risk. So if you think there's risk, there's not. You can start your free trial without even entering your credit card info. Dang, just visit ShipStation.com. Click on the microphone at the top of the homepage. Type in K-A-T-S. That's ShipStation.com. Then enter the code K-A-T-S. ShipStation.com. Make ship happen. No joke, I just finished my Athletic Greens, bro. And you know no what? No joke. Uh, you did? I saw you sipping on him. I thought, he's ready to go. I'm feeling You look good, dude. <laughs> you look like Captain Planet after you drink that stuff, dude. Oh, man. I feel like somebody just drugged me through a garden with my mouth open, man. I feel <sighs> good. You look like a summer breeze, bro. Oh, uh, thanks. I think that's good. Dude, the one thing health experts, dietitians, athletes, and top performers all agree on mm -hmm. is that a perfect diet doesn't exist, man. You need some help. Mm -hmm. You need some help. You need someone to help you cover your nutritional basis. You can't do it through food alone. So ding, ding, ding. Athletic Greens, come on down. Yep, you need that full body header. Athletic Greens includes prebiotics, probiotics, probiotics. Man, it'll make your hair look nice. Enzymes. All in one athletic drink. Dude, 75 ingredients to make you feel right. 75 vitamins. Not ingredients, vitamins, bro. It's your one-stop shop to help support your body's nutritional needs across five critical areas of health. Energy, immunity, gut health, 
hormone, neural, and healthy aging. Bro, I tried to sniff it the other day because I'm so in love oh, yeah. with it. Not the way to go. It oh, burns. Yeah, really? It burns. Put it in water, man. it still man. helps, I bet. Dude, I felt pretty good. Yeah, and look yeah. at my nose. I'm breathing just fine. <laughs> Dude, start your day the right way by squaring away your nutritional needs with athletic greens yep i love the containers that it comes in i love that a little uh the the scoop the stuff is so fresh i just feel good man i just feel good it's poignant man whether you're taking steps toward a healthier lifestyle or you're an athlete whatever athletic greens takes the guesswork out of everyday good health so jump over to athleticgreens.com slash k-a-t-s and use our special offer today for 20 free travel packs valued at $79 with your first purchase. Dang, yep. that's athleticgreens.com slash K-A-T-S. Yep, support the podcast, guys. We could use the help. Get athleticgreens.com slash cats. Should we start a new segment? Yeah, let's do it, man. Let's move along. That sounds like a good idea. Race my case. You want to do it? Oh, yes. let's do it. Want to do it? Speaking well, of racism. For, yeah, speaking of racism, <laughs> let's make a show out of it. <laughs> so uh, for this segment, uh, we researched some odd crimes, and we're just going to give you the description of the crime and, like, the headlines, and you guys are just going to have to talk it out and guess. Don't these. cheat, Chin. Chin's cheating already. It, and is it, is it current crimes? or do, Like, don't give me old shit. What do you mean? They're crimes. <laughs> what you, I wish what we would have. I need, no, you know how many crimes happen in L.A. today? <laughs> yeah, but bro. <laughs> well, they want to be fun. Yeah, he's not a We fun. can't just do carjackings the whole time. Yeah, you think he's a <laughs> cop, bro? This guy, you think he's <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> I do. Look at him, dude. This is a great note for next time, but these are old, so. Okay, okay. <laughs> I probably know. You probably know a lot of them, Derek. Oh, I can't wait. I, I might have did a couple. Let's go. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Let's do it. Number one. Police arrested a 24-year-old company employee for smearing his own excrement on a girl. Oh, that's a white dude. This that, is some white shit. <laughs> well, I feel like... White people literally do that, literally, man. Yeah, white, literally. white shit. I feel like it is... <laughs> immediately yeah. it comes to white guy, but I don't know a lot of different kind of orient traditions from the orient and that's where i want to go to chin seems like he has intel on this or i see him nodding his head can, can i just piggyback on this because i have seen some interesting porn in my day where oh, when it comes to shit disgusting. the asians partake in what Jesus they call Christ. i'm sorry scat babes <laughs> so it could be asian or white uh what is it called white for five thousand out <laughs> what scat babes oh yeah, to make it. Why do up. they do that? You can't. Does poop not smell in Asia or something? <laughs> <laughs> they just get really nasty. There's just they've done everything. They want to get as nasty as possible. I'm thinking Japanese, by the way. Okay, I bet you are, Playboy. So he's going Japanese. Chan's going Japanese. Derek, what in? What do you have? Yeah, I'm gonna go Korean. <laughs> Ooh, because there was also a level of woman shaming, and the guy rubbed yeah, it on yeah, the woman. On the woman. There's and a level of, of I'm a man. Korean and, men hate women. Yeah, yes. you're right. If you guys need another <laughs> sentence, let me know. We have no. Uh, Someone may have said the correct one already, but... Is there a quote? Uh, no quote, but uh, on December 5th at 9.45 p.m., Blank used a bicycle to come up from behind the girl, aged in her late teens, at an intersection. Why, dude? Bike? Ooh, Asia, when's the last time someone Asia on a bike? Uh, all of Asia. <laughs> <laughs> Not in America, bro. And this happened in America, I'm assuming. Do, can I get a place in time? Well, no. That, that's gonna, that's <laughs> can, not can you use it in a sentence? I'm not, I'm not giving any locations or names. <laughs> can you give me the Greek meaning? <laughs> can you use it in a sentence? Blank, w- who was <laughs> has been charged Hit with assault, an and calm down. <laughs> admits to the allegations, telling police that the excrement was indeed his own. Hell okay. yeah. That's a white dude being like, fuck you, bitch. I don't know. I feel like a white guy would use somebody else's shit. <laughs> <laughs> You know, that's um, all we do is take other people's shit. Yeah, there you go. So I think we would use somebody else's dung or whatever they call it, feces, to pull off the crime. Nah, if there's a white guy using other people's shit, he'd be in like a Fubu jersey and listen to hip hop. This is just a dude, straight up white dude, shit, upset. Probably kind of cheating on him. Quit saying shit so much. Sorry, man. dude. So uh, Brandon's final answer is white. Theo, what are you saying? I'm gonna go. We need a specific Asian. Okay, say just Asia. I'm gonna go. Uh... I'm going to go Koreans, the dark Japanese. <laughs> and uh, we do know we're conflating a little bit nationality and race, but it makes the game better. The answer is... <laughs> well, did everybody lock in? Oh, 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 so good catch. Um, I'm going to say white dude, because Asians will only do that if it's consensual. And, and, and Asians will only do that if they have an erection. Cats on to some. <laughs> <laughs> <Okay. laughs> Wow, this is a good game. Yeah, fun. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm so excited. I hope I'm right. Okay. I feel All like right. we're I feel like we're in first forty eight. 
<laughs> this is what the cops are doing behind the glass. Yeah, yeah. We're true detectives. <laughs> what do you got, Nick? Uh, Derek, what, what was your final? I, I went Korean. I was oh, Korean. Oh, word, word. word. Uh, the answer is Asian slash Japanese. <gasps> oh, my God. Fuck! <laughs> And it, it did happen in Japan. God. Oh, that Damn. makes so much sense. <laughs> that makes so much sense. My, that my, makes my so first, much sense. Eh? My first. <laughs> they, 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 <sighs> Asians do play with the shit. They do play with the shit, dude. Quit saying it so much. They, all right, they do play with the feces. There you go, man. <laughs> Asians in their own country play by a whole different set of rules. Apparently, them boys, <laughs> them boys are freaky. They take it over the top. Okay. I've seen some awful stuff. Yeah, I, 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 I've never seen any of that. You, uh, you don't want to, brother. <clears throat> I don't want to, and that's why I don't <laughs> and take it into my life. If you want to ruin your day, <laughs> scat babes. No. No, How'd sir. How'd you find that? College, dude. College. <laughs> we got a lot of time on our hands. Someone brought it up. You know up. who has a lot of time on their hands in college? People who aren't doing well at college, dude. <laughs> yeah, right. no, Go to class, college bro. athletes. Yeah. <laughs> we're playing football and watching scat bait videos. Oh, yeah, and winning football games. All right, what else you got? Number two. Man arrested for allegedly allegedly throwing a three-foot live alligator into a Wendy's drive through window. Ooh. This uh was this was, was this juvenile who did this the rapper? <laughs> <laughs> this sounds like specifically one of the big timers would have done this. No, he was twenty three. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Hmm. This is in America. Could be. Am I right, Nick? You can't ask that. Do we? Well, what do we? Do we get any? Do, do we get any clues? Uh, yeah, if you need more sentences, he pulled the twenty three year old man had pulled up to grab his order, and a server handed him a drink. When the order, when the worker turned around, the man allegedly uh, reached into the back of his truck Hell and threw yeah. the alligator through the open window. Now hold on. Now you said truck, okay? <laughs> alligator, check. Uh, <laughs> the, the 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 soft drink we speak of. I'm, I'm, you just kind of if blink if I'm onto something. Was it a sprite? Do they say what kind? They do not. Because hmm. if it's Diet Coke, this is white boy all day. <laughs> if it's a Sprite, you threw a fucking yeah. curveball into the... Yeah, if it was double grape. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. It was orange soda, Brendan. Uh, I'm going to go... For me, he reaches in the back of a truck, has an, happens to have an alligator back there. This sounds very white or Vietnamese to me. Yeah. This is as white really. as it gets. Truck, alligators... I'm going honky on this one. Me too. Honk, honk all day. Do you know what the fast food restaurant that was? My was? Question. It was, was a Wendy's. It was, was a, a Wendy's? Wendy's. That's everybody loves Wendy's. I know, dude. They're chick. They're, they're the nice burger. The, the fries spicy are nuggets. nice. The spicy mm -hmm. nuggets. Mm -hmm. Get that ten piece with barbecue sauce. You know what it is. You get a frosty. Frosty, get your fries frosty with in fries. Yes. What's up? Oh. The square burgers all day. Oh. Chicken sandwich. So good. Baconator. Man. They have one in Santa Monica. <clears throat> oh yeah. Wendy's. Yeah, a lot of people don't know over there on Seventh and uh, Santa Monica Boulevard. There. Everybody loves Wendy's, so it's, it's that that doesn't help. Hard. Can you use it in a sentence again? <laughs> <laughs> was the employee black or white or Asian? Or do we know what the employee race was? We didn't get details on the victim. Any JPEGs or anything? <laughs> <laughs> that would kind of give it away. Did okay, you're right. No. Good, call. Good call. All right, I'm locking in, man. I'm going to go on Whitey. How on big was one. the alligator? Three feet. That's a small gator. Yeah, that's a baby gator, that's man. A that's a small nothing. gator. Oh, oh you could tie, bro. Gator. Yeah, you could tie that around your foot and say it's a shoe. Dude. I don't know why this is. <laughs> I don't even know why this is news. It sounds like he's giving him a gift. I'd be stoked if someone threw a fucking alligator in there. Oh, sick, man. Oh, yeah. Thanks, dude. Oh, I'm gonna raise it as my own. Bro, that's a churro in Vietnam, dude. Oh, yeah, dude. <laughs> Foot alligator? Gang shit. I'm gonna go white all day. I'm white. White, white. Uh, white dude from Florida. Mm. Mm. White dude. Got Cat with the bonus point. He was Floridian white man. That sounds wow. like some Florida shit. <laughs> Chin, you didn't even guess. I know. <laughs> wow. Yeah, don't participate in your own life. That's good. <laughs> um, Watch your life pass by, Chin. Okay. Yeah, so Cat gets that bonus point. Man, yeah, he did. Mm -hmm. All right. Give us one more, dog. One more. La last one. Man urinates in Walmart as he puts trout in his pants. Ooh. Wait, how is he doing both? <laughs> yeah. Man was arrested after he urinated in Walmart while trying to put a package of trout in his trousers and then told police officer that he wasn't concerned because his crimes were only misdemeanors. There's nothing whiter than trout. The block is hot, baby. It was 1.30 on a Wednesday. 1.30 in the afternoon. I can, can you give us the city in this one? It's Walmart. Yes. Could be anywhere. Do we, do we want to give the city? I can give the city if we need more. 
Might as well. You want the city, Theo? City of Walmart. what? Where this Walmart? City at? of God. <laughs> Brazil. He also <laughs> said he had, he was uh, had been consuming alcohol. Mm-hmm. Standard. And what he's hiding trout? He's hiding a package trout, so frozen trout. These are not live trout. Ooh, that would make me urinate. I think if you go cold <laughs> frozen trout straight to your wiener area, put a couple of trouties near my pelvis, and try to pretend like you didn't. That's the hard part. Then that's where you shock your nervous system and you urinate. But stealing trout, man, that shit's cheap. <laughs> trout at Walmart? Yeah, man, <laughs> things are rough, dude. And he knew it was a misdemeanor, so he knows. Mm-hmm. He's been th- through this. He's been through the system before. Yeah. yeah, this just sounds like somebody who's just out there. You know, like they just happen to pick up anything. It happened to be trout. Black. <laughs> <laughs> I want to know why, 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 buddy. He knows the system too well. It's a misdemeanor. <laughs> yeah, this sounds like maybe somebody he just. He was like, salmon. Uh uh-uh, uh. That trout's cheap as fuck. Here we go. <laughs> like maybe he's trying to go to jail. Like maybe he's trying to so get. Maybe he knows if he gets caught, it's like, nah, I'm not going to put him away too long, you know? I did a stint for stealing fucking crab. You can't I'll, take away your right to vote for a misdemeanor. Yeah, right. Yeah, there you go. I'll go black. I'll, I'll, I'll go black as well. Just because I've already done too. some of the other. I can only say white so many times. <laughs> 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 I think Asian again. Yeah, I'd say Asian too. Yeah, mm-hmm. I think no Asian. No way. Korean or Asians something. Asians aren't in Walmart? Chinese. 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 In Walmart? Yeah. 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 If I know I Nick, right? though, if I know Nick, it's not a black guy. No, he, I, it's it's going to be somebody else. Racist. Huh? <laughs> <He's> <laughs> like, no. like we don't There's just crime. never black guys on there. It's just always Asians. So like, <laughs> white no, <laughs> Asian. No, the Korean. I just, I would, if I, here's the thing. If I had to watch somebody do it, honestly, I'd like to watch a black guy do it. I think that's why, <laughs> yeah. honestly, because they would do it in the most fun way. Agreed. Sure. You know? Uh, this man was from Clarksville, Tennessee, and he was black. black. Wow. <laughs> Not, no, not, we, yeah, we, so co- that was a cold case. We just solved it. Really? <laughs> <laughs> that was the coldest case. It was frozen. It was cold. Cold case, baby. I did think about as a bit just doing three white people. Yeah. That'd be I, hilarious. <laughs> and I'd probably get them all right. But it's good to know that everybody's doing crime, and it's good to know that... Uh, That's the important part. Yeah. Everybody's doing it. Race my case. So who won? <laughs> I think I think Cat, Cat took Cat, it with that bonus yeah. point. That bonus point. Mm-hmm. The Florida oh, one. Yeah. Like I said, I think that's more of a gift, tossing someone a three-foot alligator. Mm-hmm. I mean, it's a lot of but responsibility, work, but... When you're at work, I think give it to them when they leave and work. You know yeah, what I'm saying? It's not, very, it's it's not convenient, drive. you know? Yeah, you're in the middle of two drive through orders and somebody fucking throws a new pet at you. <laughs> that sounds drastic. All right, dude. Let's get this bus on the highway. What do we have going on today, son? Fun game, though, guys. That, that was, was fun. Game. Race my case. If you guys have a couple, can they submit them? Uh, Yeah, I I would love that if you submit them. Uh, Just include all the information, as many details as possible, and uh, definitely try to specify, highlight the the race. So it makes it easy. That's fun. That's fun. Mm -hmm. That was a lot of fun. Crime. Crime has no. Happens, man. Crime has no color. That's true. I think that's what we learned, guys. (laughs) (laughs) I did feel like I learned too, man. What, Theo? Nothing. All right. <laughs> Dude, Manscaped sent me their new stuff. Mm-hmm. They sent me the third generation Manscaped trimmer. Oh, I haven't opened it yet. It looked pretty pretty frosty, and I didn't know it was just for your nuts. Mm-hmm. I put it on my face. Did you? And it still worked there, dude. It still worked there. Wow, yeah, <laughs> yeah dude. dude. I look like Razor Ramon, bro. I do notice your face. Your cheeks are getting real hard when a woman walks by, though. I yeah, am dude, it's, that. A little, it's a little weird, dude. Yeah, yeah look. I've been talking about Manscaped for a while now, man. I use it. I love the trimmer. The I still have the 2.0, but I, I love the trimmer that they have, man. The lawnmower, dude. You it's, you haven't started living until you get that lawnmower 3.0, dude. It's available right now, right now, dude. Well, I just know the stuff that I have is keeping my junk nice. And also, what I start to notice for myself, you know, I get these beautiful st- kind of swaths of hair <laughs> along too, my head, like a Billy Dick Goat. Me yeah. too, dude. I use it there. I get those thigh burns, you know. I get real. I kind of have sideburns on my hip. Yeah, I get some like uh, like chops. Like I almost get like some sideburns on the inside of my legs. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. Really? Yeah, dude, I get them James Deans Ooh. going down the middle of my thighs here. Ooh. So I got to trim those up too. Yeah, you should, boy. It sounds hot in your pants, brother. <laughs> I bet your pants come off easy with all the sweat you got going dude, on in there. Lying, dude. I feel like a Russian. Look, if you're listening to me speak right now. You're one of the first people to hear about this life-changing product from Manscaped. 
Uh, they've upgraded to a 7,000 RPM wow. motor <laughs> with quiet stroke technology. Now, I'll say this. I've been using quiet stroke technology for decades because I used to have to stay over at my grandparents' house when I was about 16. Hey, also, 7,000 RPM motor. Dude, I might use it for my freaking <laughs> my boat as well, dude. Get around. Oh, dude. Shave your nuts. Get around town. Oh, yeah, dude. Oh, bro. Oh, you could debarnacle a battleship <laughs> with that bad motor scooter. Dude, 7,000. RPMs. <laughs> look, bro, your nuts will never look the same. <laughs> Dude, if Robin Williams had in Jamon, you'd be just fine. Bro, your nuts are going to look like a like an old board game. Here's what I'm saying. Get 20% off and free shipping with the code KATS at manscaped.com. Get 20% off and free shipping with code KATS at manscaped.com. Use code CATS, manscaped.com. Your balls will thank you. What want, else we got? Want to take it old school, a little debate club? Yeah, let's do it, Towley. Look how high you are, dude. <laughs> Towley. Damn, dog, I'm high as shit. <laughs> high to all. Fucking look at Towley over here, bro. Yeah. <laughs> What's Towley, like a racial slur? No, Towley's from South Park. The Towley's Tally. high as fuck. He's always high. High oh, to all. Oh, I've heard that. I haven't seen the uh, the animal, though. <laughs> You ever seen Tally how high he is? Uh-uh. Oh. I don't think so. Remember picture of that animal? Derek looks a little like Tally. Tally. Oh. He looks a little like... Uh, Jimmy Walker. Bobby Lee legend. roasted me last night. Bobby oh, Lee did? Yeah, what did he say? He said, Derek, why do you look like a 1988 Oprah? <laughs> I was like, oh my God. <laughs> oh. Just, everybody. Boom. I had to walk off the patio. He's on I had stage? To leave. Oh, it's on the patio? <laughs> on the patio. I'm hanging, and he just came up. <laughs> I was like, all right, I'm done. The <laughs> starter was, Oprah. That's crazy, man. <laughs> you, you look like, yeah, that was when she was broke. <laughs> yeah. when she She's was, always wearing baggy clothes. Oh, yeah, still doing Jerry Springer shit. Yeah. <laughs> look at this midget. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Yeah, Tally, there's his eyes. He's Look always, at this he's spicy good. nugget. Oh, there he is. I could see it a little he's bit. He's always getting high. I could see it a little That's bit. Right well, you look like Stewie. I'm a bong guy. Yeah, you I'm have the like, eyes yeah. of Stewie, though. Yeah? Yeah, from Family Guy. I think that's a compliment. I'll take yeah, it. Yeah, I, th- I think it's thing. a compliment. Yeah. Tally's a compliment. Tally's a compliment. He's funny. All right, let's do this. Yeah. Howdy ho! <laughs> All right, boys. Up first, we got Danny from Brownsville, Texas. Brownsville. One ticket to Brownsville. Huh? I ain't talking about your high school. What? Brownsville, one of my friend's grandmothers live in Brownsville on the border. Is Actually, it, she died. She passed away. Still, it's the memory that counts. But she did live there. Is, is this Texas? Yep, this is Texas. Why there we go, bro. Que paso, mi amigo, eh? Hey, sweet mustache, homes. Hey, yo. Hey, yo, what up, Brandon? What up, deal? Love the fucking podcast. I got a debate club for Get y'all. Hand off our face. Who has the better movies? Al Pacino, Robert De Niro. <laughs> Both legends, both have classics, but who has the best collection of movies? Why is he talking about gang two? signs? Uh, yo, probably, love from South gang Texas, to to. Brownsville, Texas. Gang shit. Yo, your Spanish on point. Buzz, buzz, gang, gang. Igual, papa, gracias. Yeah. <laughs> papi, bueno, bueno. Si, sí, papi, thank you. Si, sí, bueno. bueno. Buenas noches, papi. <laughs> Uh, thank you very much, our amigo. We're, we appreciate you sending this in from there, from Brownsville, from the border, bro. Y'all hold it down over there. Hell yeah, dog. Um, that's a good question. I'm going De Niro, man. Hoo-ah! <laughs> that's Al Pacino. I'm going Pacino then. <laughs> you- <laughs> Hoo-ah! Yeah. De Niro got too political for me. I'm going Pacino, no, bro. Here's the other problem. With Robert De Niro, he was fucking crushing it when he was younger. And then all of a sudden, he gets this girlfriend, right? And she wants all this shit. So then he has to keep making these shitty movies. So he, he started, towards the end of his career, she started making shit movies, yeah. dude. Being the dad or the grandpa and everything. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Dude, the Irishman's pretty. I mean, it's like, it's bad. It's almost like a book. Well, my problem is they look like avatars. Like the, the, the makeup, dude. Just hire young actors. Yeah. Just hire young. I don't need the digital shit. Well, it's just like now some of these movies, and I do respect, I mean, it's like when somebody gets into their prime, it's like they almost make a movie where you just get to look at them for two hours, you know, yeah. or look at them for three hours. Hoo-ah! Yeah. <laughs> Dude, that was so good. I'll go Pacino. Who was in Taxi Driver? That was Pacino? Oh, that was De Niro. De Niro. De Niro. De Niro. Yeah, wow. De Niro. <laughs> Raging, Raging Bull, De Niro. Mm. Heat, De Niro, and Al Pacino. Huh. Meet, Meet the, the parents? parents? That's my Robert favorite. De Niro. De Niro. Come on. Goodfellas, wow. Robert De Niro. Casino. Casino, Robert De Niro. Hmm. Makes it real tough. And what's some Pacino ones? Uh, Insomniac. How you mm. Out of all the movies, you got Scarface. Godfather's Scarface. Godfather's. Scarface. I watched it with my grandma. Uh, Carlito's Way. Ooh. 
Mm. Uh, Serpico, whatever it's called, Serpico. You know where he's the cop? I don't know what you're talking about. It's a great one. <laughs> yeah, I'm a st- I, I, uh, I love that movie with the blah. Uh, hoo ah! Hoo ah! Where's Scent the, of a woman? Yeah, Scent of yeah. a woman. Dude. Hoo ah! I'm smelling money! You know? <laughs> Just a pervert, dude. Some blind guy wandering around. Dude, I like Al Pacino and Jack and Jill with Adam Sandler, too. I like that movie, He's too, good dog. That. Yeah, he that is. He's underrated. It is. Some um, of that. Yeah. I'm trying to think. I don't know, man. Robert De Niro's a motherfucker. He's a mon. Yeah, I mean, look, there's a lot of great options out there. Godfathers, though, those were so great. He. Well, they're both in. I know. Yeah. What are some other movies, Robert De Niro? Robert De Niro's some big boys, though. Casino. Goodfellas. Goodfellas. The Intern. I'm just naming all the shit. He, he, he's had some rough ones. He had some rough ones. He's he had some rough ones. ones. I think Babe Pig in the City he was in. <laughs> he was the city. <laughs> Was it, he was a fish in Shark's Tale. He was a fish in Shark's Tale. He did the comedian. Yeah, he's been. Oh, he's in bat. Joker, bro. Oh yeah, that was he great. He gets blast in the face. Spoiler alert. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> well, that movie's been out for so long. He was I in Dirty that. Grandpa. Uh, he's been in some downhill. Dirty Grandpa. Oh, he was on Saturday Night Live three times. Dirty five Grandpa times. was tough. That's an L. <laughs> the Intern. Grudge match. Like I said, he's, he made some real oh, yeah. shit Vegas. movies, dude. He made some shit movies. And he he got caught yelling at his girlfriend in a restaurant because of it. Okay. He's like, this will have to make those shit movies. That's what he said? Yeah. And he only dates black girls. You know that? Oh, So again, wow. big point for Robert De Niro. Yeah, that's another Did point. Did you know that? Point. I did not know that, dude. Oh, only likes the black lady. De Niro liked them cakes. Hell yeah. <laughs> Chocolate town. That's a big <laughs> point. That's a huge point. Because I'm with him. Men 15 of Honor, minutes, that's a dude, great one. 15 minutes, Men of Honor. Okay, let's get over to Al Pacino then, man. This is too many movies this guy's done. He can't be good <laughs> if he does that many. <laughs> he, he's gotten super political, though, too, right? It's all political. It's a little now. weird now. I like when he cussed on CNN, but see, though. Older people he's like, get I don't give like a that. Fuck. Older people get political. They always do. Yeah, well, there's nothing else to do, is there? Now, Pacino is definitely held up better, I think. Dude, Dick Tracy? Wow. He was- oh, dude, hold up. Dude, Willie Beeman? You're gonna go out there. Every inch, we Every fight inch. for that inch. We fight for an inch. <laughs> Every inch. Yeah. Hoo-ah. Yeah, yeah. Such a good scene. Oh my god. What was that? Do you remember when he hooked up with that prostitute? Oh, any given Sunday. I don't think I've oh, seen dude, that. Oh, dude, my favorite movie of all time. Once, once upon a time in Hollywood. <sighs> you didn't like it? Like it? What was it? <laughs> it was kind of, I guess, a documentary of. Charles Manson. <laughs> what? <laughs> Narrated by it was Quentin Tarantino. The worst. Oh, I ever. loved it. Oh, I loved it. Ocean's Thirteen. He was bombing that. Ocean's Thirteen is good, man. Yeah, I like that one. Uh, Two for the money. Angels in America. Geely. Oh, do, do, oh, Geely. Yeah, that's a knock against him. Any given Sunday, dude. Two for the money. Devil's Chinese Advocate. Chinese coffee. He was in some bad shit. Too. Donnie Brasco. Carlitos. <laughs> Chinese Ray. coffee. I'm, I'm going with Al Pacino for the win. Ooh. Are you? You know what? I'm gonna Every go, inch. I'm going with Al Pacino because Sin of a Woman really did it for me, man. Wow. Oh, I smell some hair. Oh, I want to smell some panties. Dude, I wish we could play that. And we fight for that inch. Yeah. When we get him on the run, we're gonna keep him on the run. We're gonna go, go, go. We're gonna go, 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 go. We're not gonna stop. We're not gonna stop. We keep going. So we get after Rudy. <laughs> yeah, we get across yeah. that goal line. They don't keep going. They're getting across the goal line. They're just traveling around the city with the ball. <laughs> Rudy is offsides. I stand by that. What else we got? Sixty-three <laughs> uh, percent De Niro. Wow. Ah, fuck it. <laughs> That's all right. all right. A lot of people want to get L's today. There you go, boy. Here's a plate of L's for all of y'all. <laughs> L's up, hose down. L's up, boy. This is our boy Jamie from the United Kingdom. Hey, mate. Is that all I want. What up, Brandon? What up, Theo? Cat, Derek, Chin. First and foremost, thank you to Nick, everyone. Bro? You guys make me smile a lot, and I need it right now, so big up. Gang um, brother. My name's Jamie. I'm from the UK. Essex I'm brother, Sheffield here, son, represent. Uh, showing off some little women at the moment. Um, and I've got a debate club for you. What's scarier, spiders or snakes? We don't get snakes <laughs> here, so it's easy to choose. But I have the impression that Theo has wrestled a python or two to the ground. Yeah, and his butt. I know that Brendan's wrestled a snake or two. If you catch my drift. Um, <laughs> yeah. Beat so, you to the joke, homeboy. <laughs> 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 
Dang. Oh, B, that snake wrestler. <laughs> that fucking serpent. Dude, are you, are you still fighting over in England, bro? You're not telling us? <laughs> Dang, I can tell. Fight, fighting them cobras in my mouth, bro. Brendan going, <laughs> Brendan going nine rounds with a meat garter. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this milk snake. Well, I got to milk this snake. <laughs> <laughs> this milk snake doesn't have a lot of milk in it. Uh, uh, good day, brother. I'm a huge Charles Dickens fan, bro. Shout out Britain. <laughs> yeah, sh- yeah. Shout out England, bro. Shout out the UK, son. Shout out to Jack the Ripper. Um, yeah, yeah. Who else? The gentleman. Shout out that to the dope. the family yep. jewels. The gentleman. Shout out to um, Agatha Christie. I think was British. Shout out to the prince who was just like, mm, I don't want to do this anymore. I moved to Canada. Yeah, that was dude. Cool. How about that duck He's like, out I'm prince. Sick of this shit. You think he was really sick of it? You think? Yeah, he kept saying, "I need a vacation." It sounds like you. He kept saying he needs a vacation all the fucking time, yeah. and just moved to Canada. Yeah, man. yeah, dude, I would love to do that. Canada's great, man. Yeah, it is great. I moved there. <laughs> oh, bro. Except for the cold, I'd move to Vancouver. But the cold's done. I mean, cold's almost done because of the um, planet. Global warming. Yeah, I mean, uh, or just like global changing. What? Global changing. I mean, look. Here's the thing. Educate the people. You can't North. have winter. Everybody don't get winter forever, so. Hashtag never summer. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So some, at some point, Alaska's going to get the summer, and Florida's going to get the winter. That's the circle of life. Amen. <laughs> so I know some people are pissed at it because they have beachfront property. <laughs> <laughs> That's only going to be able to be used for ice skating in about 15 years. So <laughs> Glass is half, half full. Of course. Yeah. I understand where the, uh, the angst comes. Um, scarier spiders or snakes, dude. Listen, any spider, any fucking spider, I can crush my fucking foot. A snaky, a snaky. I'm fucking. I, I'm not scared of a lot of things. I'm scared of snakes, bro. Bro, I'm fucking scared of snakes. It's obvious you've spent some time with some men if you refer to it as, as a snakey. Snakies? <laughs> okay, snakies, bro. The snakies, dude. I I had one spider in my house. You were there. Oh, you guys came over to play basketball. brought it. Dude, yeah. it might have came in his fucking luggage. Yeah. He came over to play basketball. I go, dude, look at this snake. And he goes, you try, or I said, look at this spider. And he goes, did you try to kill him? I go, I did, but he fucking grabbed my shoes. Like, oh, that's your name, motherfucker. Dude, he was the biggest thing I've ever seen. Really? I, I he swear, was the size of the big I swear him. on my life he was fucking this fat, dude. Wow. I took a picture of it. It was huge. People on like Instagram told me, yeah. yeah. There's one they have a uh, there's a spider I think in uh, Australia eating a little piece of muffin you can see it online just grabbing muffin yeah can you Google that spider with muffin do you mind <laughs> I, have, have you have you seen that spider that eats fit like grabs fish there, there's a video of a spider like grabbing like a a few, like grabbing out fish of out of the water dude Damn. and then throws a peace sign <laughs> and goes into some no cave goes, and goes back in the cave <laughs> and then he puts it back on his Beats headphones <laughs> and walks back into his cave. <laughs> Spider, um, uh, yeah, eats muffin. Maybe spider eating muffin. Spider muffins, yeah, probably not gonna work, is it, D? <laughs> Get less high, huh? <laughs> what do you mean? It's sp- his mouth, is, his mouth is watering, looking at Susie's uh, cupcakes right now. <laughs> we say order twelve of them, dude. Yeah, Derek, some, everything he brings up is just Postmates. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just trying to get you guys to order something. Then. Trying going. to use the code cats. <laughs> Look at that spider, man! The amazing peacock spider. Wow. It has both of its arms up in the air, like, bring it, mf <laughs> Damn, dude. This thing looks like freaking, uh, who's that guy that shot himself in the hand for the Giants? Plexico. Uh, no, that was leg. Oh. Uh, John Paul Jones or something? Oh, uh, John, John Paul John Pascal. Paul. No, no, he was holding a, he was holding a firecracker. Larry yeah. Pierre Paul. Yeah, he tried arm wrestling the M80. Jason Pierre Paul. Jason Pierre Paul. Yeah, he tried arm wrestling the M80 and it blew his <laughs> fucking hands off. Now he's like this. And they had a bad season. They're like, we're all set, bro. They let him go. He said, because of my hand. I went, call it what you want. <laughs> they let him go? Yeah. Yeah. Because he went down to Tampa. Oh, yeah. French shouldn't play with fireworks. Yeah, you're right, bro. Um. Okay. I'm, I'm sure you've had some. There's some in New Orleans, there's some shit, bro. Oh, there's some definitely some you big got everything. spiders. You got the Manacondas down there. The, I saw J-Lo. Ooh, I saw that I, movie. The thing I don't like the most down in, in, in the South is a lot of frogs will hide in like the door, in between the door. I celebrate frogs. And the, uh, like the top of the, the door frame, you know? So you'll open your door in the morning and a frog will fall. Oh, you know? I like that's that. That's the thing no, I don't that's like. That's nice. They're cute. <laughs> 
I just don't like that surprise ass frog. Yeah, and they're wet. Yeah, they're always they're wet. Always wet. The Juicy snakes. Frog. Um, or the spiders, bro. Spiders come in at you at night. Uh, we had some lady stay with us when we were young, and a uh, roach crawled in her head, and she had to go to the emergency room and get it cut out. You ever heard of those people? It's usually, hate to be shitty here, it's usually Asians where spiders crawl in their ears and like lay eggs, and they have to get it out. But for them, it's like, sty- isn't that fashion over there? I feel like the Asians are always doing something so It might wild be some sort there. of ramen broth that they're yeah. trying to get out of their air. Like, oh, there's a baby bird in my ear right now. <laughs> <laughs> it was chirping away. Yeah, oh, what's that in your ear? Oh, it's a family of four. <laughs> yeah, they're sparrows. They're yeah. Like, damn. Okay. Dude, snakes all day. Rattlesnake? Being from Denver? Rattlesnake? Ask your boy Mike Stud. Like, oh, let me fucking rap and run across Colorado. It's not today, bitch. Rattlesnake in the Mike neck. Mike Posner got hit. What'd I say? Mike Stud? Yeah. My bad. That's Who's my boy. Mike Stud? That's a gay porn star, I think. <laughs> it would be a great porn star name. But he's, you bring he, up he, Mike Stud? No, he's a white a rapper, star? too. He's a white rapper, Is he? Too. Yeah, he's dope. Oh, right on. Yeah. He's my boy. Uh, Yeah, my, ask Mike Posner, Posner about your fucking rattlesnakes, dude. Yeah, he got A little up. baby one. Oh, there's Mike Stud right there heel. coming in hot, huh? Yeah, super he hot. looks a little bit like in that one picture in the blue shirt. Um, he has some dope hits, man. He looks like a little bit like, uh, yeah, right there. K, uh, who's that kid that kid that got took in Colorado, that little girl? Jean Bonnet. Jean Bonnet. Oh, because his blue eyes? He had them baby blues. He got that Jean Bonnet face, dude. This that, dude, this that dude. Oakland booty. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> that ghetto booty. Yeah, dude. Um, he was dating Jose Canseco's girl. Was he? Dude, how about he was a he was a baseball player at Duke. He was a pitcher and got injured, so he just... Fuck, he had all this time off because he had surgery, so he'd rap in the locker room all the time. And then the his boys, the teammates, like, dude, you're not bad, dude. So he's like, dude, let's film it. I'll like, do, we'll do a party and I'll rap, and you guys film it. He upload it to YouTube. Wow, blew up. What? Good for him. Now he's killing it. You know, hard, especially, dude. That's brave, bro, to just do that in a uh, if you've been an athlete to then try and rap. That's brave, oh, bro. Yeah. No, he's the man, dude. Gang I think shit, he's, he signed with uh, Post Malone. He did. Yeah, wow. he, uh, he's a yeah, he's. He has some fucking hits, man. I used his I music check him out. for my special. Yeah? Yeah. Mike Stud, son. Mike Posner went to Duke, too. Coincidentally weird. enough. Weird. Wow. That's weird. Them Blue Devils, dude. Damn, Blue Devils dropping them hot-ass beats. What mm-hmm. else you got? Uh, shout out to White Rappers. Shout out to Christian Leitner, too. Oh, dude. 54% <laughs> snakes. Hell yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, speaking of White Rappers, though, we got some more. I, th- th- there's nothing that makes me happier than white rappers. <laughs> really, there's not. It's so, it's just good for you, man. Mm-hmm. When they tell you you can't, you can, you know? Yeah. So, you know our champs, Little Brows. You guys remember Little Brows? I right? love yeah, Brow Brows. Hard. Caterpillar eyes? Hell yeah. <laughs> he went hard, dude. <laughs> he did. So, we got some contenders, though. Oh, yeah? We got some new ones? We got some new ones. Trying to knock off the king of the mountain? <clears throat> Trying yep. to knock off Brow Brows? Let's like, sample we, uh, Brows again just so we can re- the, be refreshed with that course. dirty Refresh dog. Refresh everybody's fucking memory, With that verbal bro. gerbil. Hit them, Brows. And play the last 20 seconds. Hit them, Brows, huh? And God, it comes uh, hard, bro. Culture, culture to the foreigner for my foreigners, you feel me? Damn. Hey. This shit goes so hard. Texas this should be the, just the theme song the fucking anyway. show. Come on, yeah. right? King in the sting, look, Brendan and Theo, fighter and Creole. I need to shout walk out, out New Orleans this and shout out to Theo. Colorado, more specifically, Boulder. Brendan came in with a chip on his shoulder, but it's still bold and yet it's still fire. If you don't like King in the sting, you're a liar. Brendan's got like a thousand different hustles. Grand up, I'm North Star Rack doing tires. Black Rifle Coffee, we hear you loud and clear. Your son on the email, like, please get me out of here. It's way too loud in here. Watching the Irishman eating pizza, drinking half a beer. Hey, now on kid? the D.O. Vaughn, looking like the type of dude that tries to read a song. Smoking cigarettes. With a snap back on About to hit the crib And turn Snapchat on Gang It's shit. all good We still mess with you 1800 Pico Boulevard Go get that hit I, I didn't get that reference What's Y'all that? Y'all doing great Boulevard. Thursday upload Not a minute late Y'all wanted a rap I had to demonstrate Brand new studio this Y'all feel it I hurt my neck Last Chris time listening to this in his place. <laughs> Now let's go and get Chinna a date Hey 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 He's my fave Nick, send me that track. I'm going to uh, walk on stage of that shit from now on. Oh, hell yeah. Happy, bro. Hell yeah. That shit is f- tasty, bro. Uh, dude. That puts me in a good mood. We're doing something right when I hear that. <laughs> yeah. We're doing something right. Bro. I'm going to break this table. Whoa, Lyle, Lyle. 
<laughs> You're right. Calm I'm, down, I'm road raging bro. right now. I'm roid raging. What's in that cup, dude? Test 900, bro? You got to back <laughs> off, dude. This is that D-ball dark roast stuff. Yeah, it sure is, bro. <laughs> got Dang. it from Gold's Gym, bro. That wind straw with cream, dude? You got to back off that <laughs> shit, dude. Dude, didn't you get your blood work done? Yeah. What did they too say? Much. Well, they said... They said there's a lot of black in your blood. <laughs> oh, they said they did find a couple of brothers in the stream. <laughs> <laughs> they said there's a lot of... With gar- floaties on, though. With floaties on. Everybody <laughs> calm you, down. Okay, yeah, thank you. Bro. Yeah, no, dude. No alarm here. <laughs> they said uh, your blood work's fine. There's a lot of darkness in there, but, you know. I was like, we found oh, some rays of light. That's supposed to be in there. They're like, oh, we just found a crying Jordan in your blood. I'm like, <laughs> oh, that's me. Yeah, that's mine. That's mine. Uh, <laughs> no, what did they say? Oh, I have a call with them today at 3 p.m. to find out. But there's a company called, uh, well, I mean, there's just a company that there's travels company, around. Yeah. And they, they, they'll they come take your blood. They did it last week after we got done. I took my blood. They're going to tell me we, this week what's going on. But they did tell me that I got too much blood in me. So I got to drain some blood. How, how's that happen? They test this thing called hemoglobin. It's yep. the one that looks like a Halloween. It sounds like a Halloween costume. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and they test that one. And if you have it's high, then you have to drain some blood. So I'm giving blood away. You, you, so you're gonna give some blood, and then are they gonna put you on t- the players? Put you on some TRT? They might put me on some TRT or some uppers or sidewaysers at least. No downers probably. <laughs> but uh, we'll see because also I don't know. Damn, uh, who's gonna get your blood? I don't know. Some ladies are like, I'm just sad all the time. Yeah. <laughs> just fucking. Some ladies are like, where's my tail? <laughs> I got an accent. I'm sad all the time. <laughs> I have an accent. <laughs> for, for, yeah. for some reason, I just hate this guy, Brendan Schaub, all of a sudden. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to be mean to him all the time. I don't know what bro, it is. Bro, I'll I don't tell know you, what it is. Oh, I can easily tell you what it is, dude. <laughs> it's because you're like a fucking cannibal that, <laughs> that ate his whole family, bro. That's why. <laughs> You look like a cannibal that lurks around a Dunkin' Donuts. That's what you look like. <laughs> All right, That's what, why, dude. Let's go to the white rappers. White rappers? All right. This, uh, first is Daniel. Let's try and you got Daniel. on that Jamarcus Russell jersey, bro. How dare you? Captain <laughs> L, How dare, dude. dude. He's from your fucking neck of the woods. <laughs> yeah. He's from LSU. Bro. He threw one deep ball and some dumbass <laughs> like, number one pick, number one pick. But well, first of all. Then he but, bought a fur coat. <laughs> Yeah, dude. But the fur was all fucking it was chinchilla, bro. He dyed it in straight scissor, dog. Remember? <laughs> he was like six gallons deep on that zerp. Alright, hit this white rapper. Who is he? Daniel. Daniel. Mike Vrabel. Oh, shit, Ooh. boy. Oh, look, look at this. Look at that vest, Red dude. King, baby. Ooh, this is that hot the track, strap. Right? Hot boys. Hot boys. Gang, gang, I do the damn thing. King of the Sting, I'm repping Big Brown and Rack King. Yeah. Theo Vaughn put it on for the Mullah Dawn. Every single city, he be looking for a single mom. Yeah, that's a trip. And I'm a drip like Derek Rod dogging with his chick. All the rat chin and premature Nick. Cat quit hating, get your feet out for the pick. Had to make it really quick, but tell me what you think. Say what up to Gianni, he a motherfucking twink. R.I.P. to Billy Conforto. Quit touching me, but keep touching me, bro. Yo, yo. Oh, respect, oh, that's fun, bro. man. Yeah, that, was good. On him, that was good. Yeah. Set of teeth on him, dude. Pearls, really nice set of teeth. Daniel coming in with that soft white heat. Yeah, <laughs> yeah bro. Daniel that's coming that, in. That's that easy listening, isn't it? That was, oh, some, yeah. that was some baby rap, dude. Oh, that was <laughs> nice. That's that Jimmy Stalker, bro. Yeah, like a bro. fucking comfortable brother rolling through your eardrums, dog. That's that white R. Kelly shit. Hell yeah, yeah dude. Bro. Make me want to take that's, my pants off, bro. Yeah, dude. That's that uh, a sex with only adults R. Kelly Hell shit. <laughs> I wasn't mad at that. <laughs> no, I'm not mad at that at all. Damn, my heart. That's some great lines in there. Daniel went in, man. All right, guys. And this. We have another one? What, this is the cont- uh, contender. Tyler Dale. Oh, shit. Tyler Dale. Yeah. Well, king in this thing. What you know about him? Week and they started from the bottom. Brand of God is, and I'm talking cauliflower. Also, God whips, and he talking horsepower. Gotta give credit when credit due. Hey, yo, man, I'm talking about you, grown man. Really feel them shoes. Channel fucking seven, leave you clues. Gang, gang's on the news. Yeah, if he reaching to the heavens looking for jokes, they can tell him better, and you better tell your folks. Used to do shows for five dollars, pack of smokes. Now we making gold buzz, buzz. All about the honey, ten whips, new shoes. And he got Damn. money, hair slick back, like it's always sunny. Gang, gang, buzz, buzz, one love. Dude, this shit makes me want to buy a 96 Mustang, put the top down. (laughs) Put the top down. 
About to go to Enterprise, run a Mustang. Wow, bro, a couple heaters, dope. bro. I love that rat, uh, that rat face they got on there too, bro. Uh, mm-hmm. Is that a wolf? or Is that a rat? That's a rat, baby. That's the hardest rat you ever fucking that's seen, a, no, that's, son. That's a wolf, baby. It's all good though. <laughs> I know a rat when I see a rat, son. Yeah, I don't know. What do you boys think? So you guys are picking one out of the contenders, and then the listeners will vote between the our king? champ mm-hmm. and the, the guys. You- that champ Man, goes so tough, hard, bro. bro. That oh, champ, champ is so browsing. good. Yeah. Well, the champ goes hard also because, and we also have familiarity with the champ. We've heard it before. It's a little stuck nah, in. I us, know a hot know. track when I know a hot track. <laughs> what? That bro? dude. Yeah. We're like death row. That dude's got <laughs> deep. I'm ready to sign him right now to Shab Records. Oh, I've said this before. I've said it before. I love Shaw that. Shaw Wreckers, the tow truck company? <laughs> <laughs> you know a hot track, then get some of your fucking weave, bro. That's all I'm weave. saying, dude. Bro, you got a wig on, bro. Dude, you're growing your hair out to look like mine. I'm not, I'm not doing a mullet. <laughs> yeah, you are. This isn't a mullet. <laughs> bro, that's a Wait steroid a mullet, dude. Look at the a back steroid. of that thing. Why, because I have a full set of hair? Bro, it's not, is it kind of full? It's real greasy, man. No, it's so thick, dude. I can put some products. Product in there, bro. Do you really? What do you have yeah. in there? Do you like? I'm not going on a mullet, so we look like Beavis and Butthead. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we look like live action Beavis and Butthead right yeah. now. Huh? <laughs> I can't do a mullet, bro. I wouldn't steal your steez like that. Oh, I dude. ain't Bobby Lee, bro. That's oh, you, bro. Bobby huh? I mean, he did Bobby. like check out my hair. Well, dude. Now, is that a typical Korean thing to do from Bobby Lee for him to sneak in and steal someone's style? Is that very Korean? Uh, you guys he did it so K-pop. fast, though. He did it so fast. If he just slowly did it, it'd be one thing. But he did it so fast. That's not Korean. You do it slowly. Okay, Koreans do it slowly. slowly. Yeah, because you guys, you guys took over pop music, like K-pop. Yeah. Out of nowhere, too. Slowly. Oh, K-pop is music, dude? <laughs> it's a brand of music. <laughs> it's yeah. Korean pop, K-pop. I haven't heard it. I got to check it out. Dude, it's it was a big, snack. dude. Is it good? K-pop? Yeah. It's super catchy. Who, uh, you'll love it. Who, okay. Who's the biggest one? What's their name? BTS right now. BTS. Wow. They're, they're a boy so band, So hot. Too. Did they send in a submission for King of the State? <laughs> <laughs> and they're Jews or not? <laughs> no, they're all Korean. <laughs> they're all Korean? But it's tough to tell if it's men or women. The, the K-pop, they wear yeah. makeup. Are they they're, good? They're, they're, they're like good-looking people, but you can't. It's tough, dude. I'm going to watch them. Yeah. Oh, BTS is fire dude they are oh they're tracked with halsey oh i gotta get in there Dang, I'm a, i'll be with halsey. i like this bts huh? oh dude and they're beautiful young fellas huh oh yeah wow it's hard to tell dude oh wow they are beautiful yeah that's what i'm saying good looking human beings mm-hmm. a lot of handsome boys and look at that on the left who's that one on the left he doesn't look very korean though oh yeah this one here's here's the problem k-pop the other, they make uh, these boys practice 23 hours a day out no of the 24 way. days no. you know and it's just they, they just you can tell they hate their lives i'm like the jackson five yeah yeah it's like jackson yeah it's like michael jackson's dad's your manager but guy. for all of them oh god so they're all dying inside and no and none of them are rich because michael mm. jackson's dad took all the money oh. <laughs> it's michael jackson's dad's band uh yeah yeah mm-hmm. wow he runs k-pop <laughs> Well, I think. Well, uh, good luck. So, yeah, good luck, guys. Um, uh, send, in your, <laughs> send in your submission. I'm a big fan. We'll see how it goes. Who, K pop? Yeah. Yeah, send us something. Just in. in general. If you guys want to do Chin, one. have a K pop band send us a submission. That would be freaking awesome. If there's actual K pop bands out there, amateur K pop bands, for sure. You tell me you don't know any Chin? Not personally. Hey, don't lie to us like you lied to fucking Hot Carl. I did not. <laughs> yeah, you did. Let's bring that up right now, dude. You want to really talk about... Mean. Let's bring up... Uh, I didn't want to do it, but I it just hit me, bro. Gang, gang, no, bro. Buzz, buzz, liar. Just so you guys know, and then the fans know, too. I literally... We, me and my girl dated literally after Carl was picked. But it sounds like there was something that happened on the episode, and let's bring up, there was a comment that somebody mm-hmm. sent me this image mm-hmm. online of mm-hmm. a... Huh? Um, where you said an observation, an observation, okay. you know, chin and chin and in, Do we, where you mm-hmm. um, said that you were willing to go on another date with Carl, and then at the end you tell us that you have a girlfriend. So which one was? You're talking about her tits. Yeah, you'd be down boy. for another date. I also and then, said and talking then about she, dusting she, that Muppet with your wing. <laughs> yeah, talking about that low mane. Yeah, boy. And then, yeah, that yeah. low mane. Talking that about sweet and sour, baby. Yeah, trying to vein up in that low mane, boy. You <laughs> yeah. feel me? <laughs> trying to get that. <laughs> trying to get your egg roll in them noodles. You yeah, feel you me? Dirty little Star yeah, Wars. Little fucking wants. <laughs> yeah, bro. <laughs> yeah, bro. <laughs> Oh my god! I didn't mean to call you a wonton chip. Yeah, Listen, right. and I, I would never just, call I was, you that. I, was, as a I wouldn't slur. either. But I thought we were spitting out foods. <laughs> what? 
Either way, edit that. Hey. <laughs> No, but you you sound like you were in until we found out that she thought the age was an issue, and then you kind of changed your tone. No, I was still all in, and I was gonna say that I was gonna go on a second date. For I don't want anyone, I don't want to let anyone down, so I wanted to keep it up. Yeah, but, you let us all down. Well, so when you gonna, were you gonna have a family with her? No, but I'm huh? saying be so driving across your date. family at night and have little mixed kids and let them down every night. <laughs> How long do you know what I'm saying? How, how when long does you it keep this up, Chin? No, we wouldn't. Yeah, we're gonna put a sword in your heart in your father's yard. <laughs> you gonna change your end? name? Oh God! We would have ended it there because we're not gonna go on a second date videotape, right? So we would ended it there, and then I would have told you guys later. I would have told her too, but you guys kept saying we gotta find another girl for Chin or something. Like, all that stuff I was like, no, we gotta end it right now. I have to tell you guys right now. Who's a company man? Is that what you're saying? Your company man? I literally went through man. all of it for you guys and the fans, and wow. I literally started dating my girl after. The Carly thing. After she was picked. After she was selected. Oh. So either let you guys down not go on the date or just do it and have fun. But on the date, it sounded like you were trying to go after them juggles, bro. Yeah. <laughs> a little over the top, wouldn't you say? Yeah. A little over the top. You're so were you, you acting you're trying to date? You're trying to get some teriyaki on them tits. <laughs> <Teriyaki. laughs> Am I right? Yeah. I, Am never, I right? Never. But uh, yeah, but let's hear. I just want to know the truth, Chen. Hey, yeah. what's what's your girl think about all this, Chid? Uh, she wasn't super stoked about it, but she understood. Yeah, sure. She no did. sense of humor. No, no. Korean. She was dude. cool about it. She's not Korean. Oh, she's not. No. What is she? Vietnamese. Wow. Oh. I love. Vietnamese, I'd like to say bro. again, this is not me. It's not Cat. It's not me. I promise. Yeah. No, I've met. I met the girl. I yeah. don't remember FCT, is, but I met the girl. <laughs> is Cat still I met single? Her many times. Yeah, yeah. You didn't know that Derek was with you in whatever city you guys were in two weeks ago. <laughs> San Jose. Where? Yeah. No, I knew you were in San Jose. It, it, it happened on the episode. You forgot, but yeah, yeah it's you, for, fine, it's okay. you forgot again. It all, it all ties together. <laughs> I feel you, bro. I feel you. Welcome to Below the Belt. <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 fuck. I didn't. <laughs> Dude, you never know when CTZ. I'm like Batty from Fern Gully, bro. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Remember him, Rob Williams? Uh -uh. Oh wow. Yeah, and he killed himself after that role. No, not the bat, dude. Not the bat. Sorry. The bat was he had issues. Sorry. <laughs> he had some bats in his belfry, man. R.I.P. Robin Williams. So right. your girl wasn't too happy, Chin. I'd, I'd like to maybe do a, cool. a video with her and see what her thoughts are. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, she can, we, can we FaceTime her? If she would like to send in a video and let her know, and let her know her honest thoughts because I feel a little bit deceived and I'm not even... No! I had to go through with it, right? But did it seem... You were live with him, Kat. Did mm -hmm. it seem like he was willing to escalate the date to sensual levels if, if, if it presented If Carly itself? was down, yeah. Be honest, Kat. Be honest. No, hold on. Let me, uh, let me ask that. Did you know he had a uh, girlfriend, Kat? Did he mention it at all to you before? Yes, I did know. Well, case solved. This is it was a cold case. That kind of slow. she cat wouldn't lie. I thought maybe so. Cat, so he's on the up and up here. He's on the so up. So cat was up. in on the lie oh. too. Wow, <laughs> she wasn't a lie. I'm hurt, guys. It was after <laughs> we picked Carly. All right. So either I don't do it or just do it and pretend and have. I I did have fun though. I did, well, I'm I'd glad somebody had. Fun. Would you have let it escalate to sensual activities? I couldn't. That's why I said we. Have why to couldn't it. you? Cause I'm a girl. I mean, <laughs> that's how I am. I don't know about the rest of you guys. What? Oh, what's that I mean? I Chin, now we're throwing accusations around. <laughs> All I'm <laughs> saying, me, if you've you been with this girl for two days, if no, not Carl two days. got up them big jugs, Carl was gone for like a month or so, right? Bro, she had those milk lanterns, bro. I you know. didn't freaking latch on to one of those <laughs> freaking <laughs> warm <laughs> hillsides. You're out of your mind, bro. She had Daddy that. likes. Bro, yeah. It's going to be just fine. Carl is going to be just fine. Okay. All Are right. you guys still communicating or not? No. You texting? I just texted her. The wow. Very last night. And there we go. You <laughs> texted her for what, huh? It's for over, what? dude. <laughs> that night. Just to make sure she got home safe. Well, we need it. to find yeah. someone. Derek, break up with your girl. <laughs> <laughs> hey, cat single. Ooh. Oh I don't know if cat's the oh, one, dangerous. man. It gets creepy when we're sending a little cat out there into the world. You <laughs> That's know? true. I don't That's want scary. any blood on my hands. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Dark, bro. It's a murder. You, dude, you never know, man. Yeah. We send cat on some dark web date. I don't want that. Yeah, that's true. Jesus. At least Chin can defend himself. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Kind of. He can always pull that earring off of his ear and fucking <laughs> <laughs> and pop somebody's zit with it. Yeah. <laughs> All right, man. Let's get through this episode, man. I'm starting to get bored. Yeah, I don't know well, what's you, guys, you just guys got to pick who you like between uh. Uh, Daniel oh, and Tyler. It's tough. Pearly White Daniel or Tyler with the wolf rap. God, they're both fantastic. Yeah. And I appreciate the effort. Both real and there's no losers. There's, there's no losers. There's no losers. Mm -mm. 
I think a good tiebreaker tiebreaker is the original beat. Uh, our second guy, Vicious. He made that himself. He didn't. No, nah, man. I thought Pearly White. That's an original beat, though. It was it? Yeah, that's a original. Sample them again. Let me sample them again. Because the first one boy used the Hot Boys used beat. Used the Hot Boys beat. The Juvenile beat. Yeah. Which is fire. Which is a fire. Which I, I also appreciate. Just listening to Juvie today, yeah. Really? That's a yeah. shame. He takes a little long to get into it. And also, his magician, Rat King Best, whatever. His flow's not as good either. I like his flow. Oh, Nick's hating him. I know. Nick doesn't like him. This Mike I love Britton. the lyrics. What don't you like about him then, Nick? This, this. He's not the other guy. Dude, you're working with gang, that gang. I do the damn thing. Gang. King of the Sting. I'm repping Big Brown or Rack King. Theo Vaughn put it on for the Mullah Dawn. Every single city, he be looking for a single mom. Yeah, that's a trip. And I'm a drip like Derek Raw Dogger with his chick. Oh. Holler rat chin and premature Nick. Cat quit hating, get your feet out for the pick. Had to make it really quick, but <laughs> tell me what you think. Say what up to Gianni, he a motherfucking twink. twink. R.I.P. to Billy Conforto. Dang, quit bro. touching me, but keep touching me, bro. Yo, yo. And he Spank did that bro. during his lunch break. Yeah, Spank awesome. Yes. Lunch break hit gang shit, he did bro. it during his lunch break. That shit was hard. Give me the other one. Yeah. We were talking during his last beat. The logo threw me off. I don't know if it was like a weird... Yeah. Well, king in this thing. What you know about him? Not Dude, Dennis when Summer. In bottle, I'm in a Camaro. Is, and I'm in a Camaro. We got the titties out. <laughs> That's gotta term for credit. the top. We ain't credit do. <laughs> hey, yo, man. I'm, I'm nice. talking about you, grown man. Really feel them shoes. Chain. Channel fucking seven. Leave you clues. Gang <laughs> bangs on the news. <laughs> yeah. Keep me reaching to the heavens looking for jokes. They can tell I'm better and you better take folks. Rich, Derek. Used to be shit. Oh yeah, bro. Oh, buzz, buzz, all about the honey tan. Oh, ah, dude, shoes, and he got to get the, the money. This is the Venice Summers, bro. Yes, right. Right. That shit is hard, oh, bro. I'm gang, saying, gang. Rob, I'm riding with number two, bro. Buzz, That's buzz. Buzz. I'm riding with your boy Vicious right there. Beautiful submissions, though. Thank both it. of you yeah, guys. Thank bro. you. Shout out to White Rabbit. Gang, shit. Keep fighting the good fight. Yeah. See you guys in the future, bro. And that's it, boys. Well, well, that was quick. <laughs> <laughs> well, Chin got exposed, huh? No longer a cold case. We're all, we're all. I keep saying cold case this episode. <laughs> Everything's all, a cold case. We're all going to jail, man. We're all going to prison. 60 days in, dude. Oh, 60 sure. days in. Into what? We could do King and Sting in jail. Probably yeah. be some good content for us in there. Yep. I could see that. I could see that. Well, I'm taking my ass to Ohio, dude. I'm in Columbus Friday, Saturday. Are you really? Yeah, I am, dude. Shout out to my boy Maurice Claret. Maybe I'll come out there and see you, bro. Yeah, maybe. Gang okay, shit. Uh, I'm going to Las Vegas. So I'll be there Friday and Saturday. And that's it. That's what's going on. I got Oroville coming up. Ooh, that's a fun one. Yeah. yeah. I'm that's excited, man. You'll love that one. And send in all those video submissions. We need some relationship advice. That is oh, up. Oh, dude. Uh, we I need... forgot relationship advice. People are probably dying. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Well, they need to ask then. I know. We'll help them out. Send them in. Debate clubs. King of the Sting it. Yes, we have the information you need. <laughs> Get and, to us. Any clown my hound or chide my ride, it's way better if you use a video and tell us a little bit about the animal. Don't just send in JPEGs. Yeah, sending in a dirty JPEG of an ant. Some guys been also, there's deceased animals somebody's sending in. Yeah. It's getting a little seedy, some of it. Yeah, girls are sending in videos for threesomes. Y'all, stop being wild, y'all. Yeah. Regular <laughs> submissions. Wow. Well, we well. I mean, hey, Tim, come on, man. <laughs> hey, speak for yeah, yourself. Speak for yourself. <laughs> all of us are lying like Chin. Yeah, dude. Not, oh, not all of us are just waking up and bonging out and busting in the closest thing to us every day, okay? Dude, some I don't of know us are out so looking for our lives. Some of us want to live, bro. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I start my mornings right, Doug. Yeah. Howdy ho! <laughs> smoke will smoke will went for you over here, man. <laughs> Sir, smoke a lot. Take oh, it easy, oh, bro. Bobby. Chimney. You got to back off that bus. Smokey dude. Larkin over here. <laughs> bro, <laughs> bro, what if you quit smoking weed? I bet you it would look just like a son. That would be the crazy <laughs> thing. <laughs> I'd just get small and Indian yeah. and nervous. This, real yeah. nervous. This is your brain on weed. Hey, I bet if you stop smoking weed, you look like genuine. <laughs> <laughs> he had the hits, yeah. bro. He was hot. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> Young Bonin, oh, my saddles. Ooh. Jump on it. Dude, that was a Me Too movement <laughs> fucking waiting to happen. Dude, dude I, he's always trying to fuck somebody. <laughs> oh, bro, that was the best song to put on if you were trying to hook up. Oh, dude. Yeah. Dude, you got that on your apartment? <laughs> oh, dude. I was like, somebody sucking, dude. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> you know the Steez. Too bad I was seven years old when it came out. That's the problem. So <laughs> yeah, get, me too. Dude. Getting my penis out when That's it was the awkward friends. part. Yeah, dude. I'm out. Buzz, buzz, gang, right, gang. gang, gang. <laughs>